Hello everyone, welcome to this tutorial. So many of you have been asking me how to use MPI to run in your own PC and then uh, how to run it with GPU. Today I will show you how you can run it with GPU and MPI but you don't have to use your own PC. Rather, you can use Google Colab to run the simulation for you. So today I will be showing you how you can run LAMPS code with GPU in Google Colab. So the first thing you need to do is open your browser and paste the address given in the description below. Then you have to copy it to the drive to your drive. So, uh, so it's creating a copy. You need to copy it to your drive because un uh, otherwise you won't be able to edit those so after copying it to a new drive the first thing we need to do is we have to activate the gpu of google collab to do that let's go to edit then notepad settings and as for the hardware accelerator use gpu then save so now the gpu is activated and then we have to mount our drive of Google Colab. So to do that, put your cursor here and press shift click, shift enter, sorry. So after you shift and enter, it will ask you for your authorization code. To get the authorization code, go to this link. And then you have to verify a few things and then uh, you have to paste the authorization code here and press enter after you press enter it will give you the permission to mount your drive now we have to install lamps in our drive so just collapse all the cells and run all the cells running all the cells may take a few minutes in the meantime let's see what's in our drive so this is the main drive content.drive that this one so every files will be here so let's see what's in these cells of installing lamps so the first thing is ls cpu and nvidia smi which is used to check the system spe specification of google collab so as i'm using a free account i've given a 1 gpu 2 cpu and 12 gig of rams so here's all the details like using Intel Xeon processor and the driver name, the driver details, GPU name, GPU details. All of it is given here. Then after checking the specification, we have to use, we have to add the pre-built lamps and open chem repository by Anton Gladke. So we have to run these codes in our bash. I mean the best command line and so you can see like it's fetching all the datas and then after that we have to install lamps so to install lamps we'll be installing the lamps stable version and the docs the stable data and the open key models so we have already installed lamps and you can see like everything is done now we have to run our own lamp script so to do that, uh, I'm using MPI run, uh, LMP stable, but we don't have any file to run lamps. So we will be, we'll upload a new file. Just uploading in.crack here. Okay. And then click here and then shift enter. So here we can see the cell is running. So it ran success successfully with 4 seconds. So that is it. You can see that it ran successfully. Now as you can see it's using one GPU. So let's remove this portion and see how much time it needs without the GPU. So we'll run it again. And let's see. So it needed almost like five seconds. Uh, five seconds here you can see like 
before it was 4 second and it needed 5 second so you can see that for GPU it takes lower time it can be more visible for longer run let's edit it a bit double click it so it will open up here and let's run it for 10,000 steps and let's run it with GPU at first so it took almost 5 seconds for the GPU to run and now run it without the GPU Let's see how much time it takes. Mm. So now you're seeing a big difference that it took almost 10 seconds to run without the GPU. So you can see that GPU can save almost half of your time. So that is it. That is it for today. You can run your own input script in uh, in uh, google collaboratory also thank you for watching till now do subscribe my channel and wait for the next tutorials see you goodbye